Hi everyone, it's great to welcome you back. It's a fantastic sunny day here at Kamaya Coast. We're looking forward to share with you all the exciting news and developments with the Kamaya Coast Community Update. It is now December 2022. There's a lot of new and exciting things we'd like to share and we'd like to start off with the best meals by the beach. Of course, there's always your old time favorites, but this time we're improving it. And more importantly, a lot of new choices with the new restaurants up and coming very soon. After a sumptuous meal, I'm sure the next thing on your mind is to think about how to enjoy all these outdoor summer fun. What best way to do it than to start off at Aqua Fun? We are here right now at the phase one of Aquafan. Excitingly, in 2023, we'll have new slides and new pools, phase two. And we don't stop there. Immediately after, phase three will commence and be open by 2024. That was a lot of fun that we showed you at Aquafan. We're back here at the commercial area at Station One. And of course, to continue the outdoor activities, sun, sea, and sand. Okay, we're here to share with you what you might have missed. Here we go. After all that fun, active outdoor activity, you might want something more relaxing and essential. Hence, we're developing the commercial area to have the B-Mall. The B-Mall is meant to address your basic needs like convenience stores, pharmacies, and all other small retail activities. And to top that off, we're going to have the Fountain of Youth, a diagnostic center that will help you see what you need to improve and have a better, healthier life. Now, staying here at Kamaya Coast, of course, is a fantastic option and you'd like many hotel options. We have our existing Sands Hotel and we have Aquafun, but get ready for more at the B Hotels, which is coming very soon. We have missed all the fantastic get-togethers and activities we have and it's time to come back strong. So right now, we are developing outside of these hotels more complimentary events facilities to hold all your corporate events, parties, or anything that you would like to enjoy with your friends and family. To add to all that commercial activity, we're also developing right across the golf course what we call GTC or Golf Town Commercial. At Golf Town Commercial, as you can see, is going to have all these other amenities that will provide for your basic needs. Right on top of it will be the new residential condos right around the corner. We're continuously developing the beach villas and more importantly, we're developing CHB or the Community Home Builders. We'll show you some of the pictures and I'm sure they're all exciting to be up and running very soon for your entire family. We understand and appreciate the high demand 
for the residential units and the community home builders because of all the lots we've sold at Station 1. But we also know that there's more demand for these lots and that's why we're inviting you to move here from Station 1 to Station 2. Hi, we are now here at Kamaya Coast Station 2. We are here not only because of the natural beauty around us, but of course because of the continuous demand for residential properties at Station 1. Just like in Station 1, we are developing the best food choices available, local and international cuisine, to appease and fulfill everyone's delectable desires. After a full meal, of course, the next thing you want to know is what to do first. And here, we are developing Kinawan Golf, which is right beside Kinawan Golf Residence and Kinawan Golf Terraces. Just like in Station 1, you have signature holes that overlooking the sea and the mountains right behind you. To complement Kinawan Golf, we also have Sky Golf, which is a new interactive fun way for the family to enjoy the sport of golf and enjoy the whole development around you. It is right beside Kamaya Sky and Sky Summit. In Station 2, we are developing Seaside Promenade, definitely a new way to enjoy retail and shopping and all the other entertainment available in this area. As you can see on the videos, it is perfectly located at the cliffs of Station 2, which will give you an unparalleled view of the sea. We've got, of course, our Seaside Water Park. This water park is right beside Taman Ridge. We're going to develop and place everything we learned from Aquafan into this new water park. You know, the beauty about the developments that we do is we believe we want to be a student in all of these things. And developing this water park, we believe we are continuously enhancing our expertise, even if we've already built one. You know, the fun thing about being a student, my favorite, and I'm sure it's yours, are the field trips. Here we are a few months ago at the Yapa exhibit in London. It was a lot of fun, but more importantly, we were able to get new consultants and new suppliers to provide us the expertise to make Station 2 water park bigger and better. Our water parks not only exist in Station 1, Station 2, but of course, also our new plans for develop a mountain water park in Station 3. I'll invite you there, but before we go, I'd like you to take a quick look on an aerial view of Station 2 to know what this development reality will be a few years from today. See you guys at Station 3. Hi, we're here at Station 3 and I'm in the middle of the street, which is not good. But one thing good about Station 3, we're in the middle of a major highway, right at the center of Bataan. Now we're officially at Station 3. A while ago, we were in the middle of the road. And right behind me is the Grubhub. The Grubhub is a restaurant that will provide dentures, a Chinese restaurant, and a coffee shop, all opening in 2023. As shown in the maps earlier, Station 3 is in the heart of Bataan. And right around us will be malls and other areas that will enhance the development and usage of this facility. And because of that, we've tied up with the local government to come up with what we call the Fab Forest. The Fab Forest is a joint venture with the province of Bataan and the Freeport area of Bataan. It now provides the strategic logistical hub that we all know is more than necessary in the past years that have happened. Here at the Fab Forest, we're going to have food, overall health, resources, economics, science, and technology all together. Hopefully, all these locators that will be here soon will bring benefit to the entire province and the country. Just like in Station 1 and 2, Station 3 will of course have the resort component, the residential, the water parks, and all the other commercial facilities. But of course, the Fab Forest and Station 3 being close to the center of the population of Bataan, we're also going to develop sports and other activities in the area. Before we head out there, Join us to take a quick look at the development at Fab Forest and see the first locators developing their facilities and opening in 2023. After a short ride, we're here atop the Station 3 mountainside. As you can see, we have a fantastic view of the West Philippine Sea and the Manila Bay all at once. The elevation here is fantastic, the freshest air, 
and this is a natural wind tunnel so it'll always be windy and breezy in this area of station 3. Right behind me here is the location that we're looking at for our station 3 mountain water park. The idea here is to theme it like ancient civilizations in the middle of the jungle. And from what we've learned with water parks, we want to integrate the view. So where we're at right now is the entrance to the water park where you will have all the slides going downhill and all the wave pools and lazy rivers around the area. It's gonna be exciting and fun. Right beside the water park, we're gonna have the best food choices that matches the fun activities at the water park. And across it, we're gonna build a small stadium that will house and host the regional, provincial matches of basketball, volleyball, and all types of sports. I'm sure the local government will love it and we'll love to watch it all from here. This is one of the recreational parts of Station 3 and a stone's throw away is our first residential called Skytown. Skytown will be conveniently located near these facilities, near the main avenue that we were just at, so that living here, working here, will become a vacation every single day. As you notice, we're calling this Skytown very similar to what we have at Kamaya Sky because they are actually very close to each other. And the local government of Bataan and the province has been continuously developing the infrastructure to connect from town to town. So very soon, a road will be connecting these two within maybe a 20-30 minute ride instead of the one hour ride that we usually take at this point. To top that off, the provincial government is interconnecting these highways. But luckily, the national government is also pitching in with the Bataan Cavite Bridge up and coming very, very soon. I'm sure that bridge will change the perspective and landscape of the country. And with that bridge, it's going to intersect the entire province of Bataan, positioning station one, two, and three along the way, and definitely connecting the whole northern part of the country via the SETEX and the TPLEX. With all these road infrastructures coming into play, let's factor in as well the seaside development. We've got the ports at Mall of Asia EST, ports at Orion, ports at Fab Down Terminal, Station 1, and Station 2. And if that interconnectivity and convenience is not enough, let's fly back to Station 1 and let's take a look at Kamayapad. Here we are, safe landing at Kamayapad Station 1, a truly unique gateway called the Premium Air Park Development. As you can see, we're in full swing with construction, targeting to be finished by 2024. A few months adjusted since we increased the length of the runway in order to handle very light jets and turboprop airplanes with higher performances. Aside from getting passengers in and out of this airport and development, we're also thinking of locating various aviation-related businesses like schools and maintenance in this facility so that it becomes a one-stop shop for anything aviation related. To increase the usage and benefit to all of Kamayapad, again, we've partnered up with the government with the Philippine Coast Guard. They are looking forward to locate their air assets here strategically on West Philippine Sea to provide services to our community. This is indeed very exciting, but nonetheless, a runway is only a runway. We're gonna need airplanes to fly in and out of here. It might take some time for regional airlines to really fly in and out, so Kamaya will take the initiative by hopefully creating Kamaya Air. Kamaya Air will conveniently fly you to our best loved destinations in the country, like Boracay in Caticlan and of course, Coron. That's not the limit of where we can go, that's just the start. With Kamaya Air, we intend to fully develop our island expansion. We're very happy to share that we have now found our home in Boracay at Station 2 called Kamaya Sands, Boracay. And from Boracay, it's so much fun to travel the sea to Coron Island, which is roughly a seven-hour trip on our proud new vessel that has just arrived in the Philippines a month ago, the Kamaya Fish Adventure Cruise. Here's a few pictures to share with you so you see what we're coming up with very soon. Of course, we are all aware of the beauty of Coron and its natural lagoons. And with Kamaya Fish Adventure docked right beside the island, you will be the closest hotel right there. After that fun but long trip, you can now take a direct flight from Coron back here at Kamayapad using Kamaya Air. After all the fun island hopping in the country, we'd like to see a little bit more of the world. And in as much as we love the sun and the sea, it's always fun to see a little snow. And here we are, 
after all that fun in the sun, it's now fun in the snow. It's so cold, it's so much fun. There's so many things to do once we develop Kamaya Snow with the Filipino touch, of course. I can't wait to bring you guys here. It's been great fun traveling the islands and the world, but there's no place like home. Kamaya Coast Station 1, 2, and 3 is our home. This is a place where good things never change never-ending sunrise, and fantastic sunsets. It's all here waiting for you. Thank you for joining us in this December 2022 Kamaya Coast Community Update. We're looking forward to seeing you guys again. Enjoy the upcoming summer.